By the time we meet at the Change Board Conference, the world may have just come to terms with Donald Trump as President of the United States and Article 50 having been triggered for Britain to leave the European Union. It's clear we live in extraordinary times, times of populism or even extremism. I'd like to think that we can live in times of optimism and hope as well, and for optimism and hope to defeat cynicism and despair. But what is clear is that truth is under threat, trust is under threat, it's under threat in the world in which we live and in the workplaces where we operate every day. And these are some of the themes that I'm going to be exploring in my talk. Um, I'm going to be looking at why I think the crisis of trust is in fact a crisis of leadership and what we need to do and the new models we need to develop in order to embrace that. We'll look at why the organisation of the future needs to be more open, more adaptive, more creative, more collaborative. These are themes that we've all heard before, but how does it play out in the world of truth and trust? What does it mean uh, for the everyday work of the organisation? At the heart of my work and that of Jericho Chambers, we're looking at new models based on vulnerability and dissent, on activism and co-production, of accountability to the many, not the few. If we can reorganise our workforces, not as traditional hierarchies, but as social movements, we've got a way of saving the world for the better, changing the world for the better, and as I say, replacing cynicism and despair with optimism and hope.